After several public forums, the city of West Lafayette has drafted a plan for State Street. News 18 Samantha Tiki reports on the proposed design changes and what they will do for the community. State Street is a major travel route for Purdue students and fans of Purdue sports. And whether they are walking, driving, or biking, its current condition may not be the safest way for pedestrians to travel. I try to avoid it as much as possible because the traffic is terrible. When like there's snow on the ground, the sidewalk is quite narrow and I, I feel really cramped against the side of the street sometimes. And after months of public input, the city has drafted a master plan to revamp a two and a half mile stretch of the road. It's going to have much more interaction between pedestrian and bicyclists. It's going to narrow the scope of the street and also in most cases make it two way. The plan will affect State Street from the 231 corridor through Airport Road just past Purdue University. West Lafayette Mayor John John Dennis says the main goal is to make travel safer for pedestrians, but the revamp will have another positive effect, particularly in the village. We want to make sure that it's accessible by all. So if bikes can get there, if pedestrians can get there, if our student population can get there, and our permanent residents can get there, that is going to be a boon for our entire community. The plans include two-way traffic through the village, wider walkways, separate bike trails, and two roundabouts at River Road and Tapawingo Drive to help with pedestrian safety. Dennis says the plan is in its infancy, and although it could change, this current plan would benefit everyone. The State Street Master Plan is the vision. It's what we would love to see. It would be the best fit for what we feel is in great need for this community at this time. The best fit, and in some opinions, the best way to keep people safe on State Street. More room for a separation between the bikes and the students is the safest way to go. If it's actually safer for crossing, I kind of like that for a pedestrian. Dennis says the next step is to bring the plans to Purdue University administration and community members to get more input before the engineering process begins. In West Lafayette, Samantha Tiki, News 18.